Alright, so I'm at my favorite shot spots for the conveyors. And um, so this is what we have. Yeah, you see that? Yeah, he told me I have to tarp. I don't have to tarp this, the stainless steel. But I have to tarp this stuff right here because it's painted, right? It's painted, but guess what? It's been sitting outside and you see all the rust, you know? This is like one of the things where I feel like I'm just gonna go ahead and just take it anyway and say the hell with it. But, and it has some sharp edges. But I'm gonna go ahead and tarp it. It's the weekend. It's a nice, humid day out here. It's not too hot, overcast, as you can tell. We had thunderstorms last night. So, yeah. It's a nice, easy load. I think I'm only like 30,000 pounds. <sighs> it's not too bad, the tarp. I'm just gonna let the tarp hang right here. I'm not even gonna try to strap it down. Um, I, I measured it with my foot and like right about here, I'm gonna be at like 22 feet. So even when I gotta pull some, shit, you know what? I don't know. Anyway, so that's this load. We're going to Kansas City, it's a day and a half drive. $2,500. Well, I ain't gonna lie, 24. 24 and some change. And uh, it's like, what, 700 miles to Kansas City? Because I know if I do, I could do, what, 400 and I'll be at Effingham? Because usually, like, between Effingham and St. Louis, like, there's only one truck stop. Well, there's, there's some smaller ones. I don't know. Whenever I come home and I'm headed, like, towards uh, Kansas or whatever, I always stop in Effingham. It's like, I always have, like, maybe two to three hours left to drive. So, oh, that's what it was. Yeah, that's right. So I could get to St. Louis, but um, it gets kind of iffy where to park. Oh, I'm sorry. I wasn't even looking at myself. All right, man. Oh, so I got some new tires right here, right? And these tires are Cooper tires. I don't know if you can tell, but they're Cooper. And uh, they're all right. They're good. They're cool for whatever reason. I wanted to give me some more Bridgestone right here. They were pretty cool too, but I couldn't get to my spot. But um, as of right now, my tires are good. I have, I have, um, I got some decent tread on my um, drives, right? So I'm not driving as much. So my tires aren't wearing as fast. And then um, this one right here, I'm gonna have them rotated because I have a front end alignment problem. Yeah, but that's about it, y'all. So I holla, peace. All right, so I got my tarp laid out. As you can tell, I have the blankets for the corners. It's already torn, it's already ripped, but I have blankets set at every corner position. Those black ones are very small. Where is it at? That one. So what I'm thinking, and I got another one black right there. I'm thinking I'm gonna put this blue one up there and then get these two black ones and put on these back, back corners. And um, then I have my smoke tarp right there. I don't know what I'm gonna do with that. But yeah, that's it. All right, this is the finished product. I don't care about the back. I'm not too worried about it. But, uh, yeah. It doesn't look all that bad, right? It's not shabby. It's not shabby, right? Uh, yeah, this right here, I didn't have a lot of, I don't know. It's humid in the mud, man. It's humid in the mud. So yeah, I'm gonna head on down. 
So, yeah. Peace out.